Hi, my name is Cheryl Kalina Reeves. Hi, my name is Harvey Singh. And we're real estate property investors. I'm sitting here right now with George Ross, Donald Trump's right hand man, celebrity apprentice judge, and JT Fox's coach. So, George, tell me, what do you look for in a business partner and investor? A business partner and investor, they, well, they could be two different ones. The business partner doesn't necessarily have to be an investor because an investor basically is going to put in money. Where the business partner may furnish not only money, may furnish something else, some expertise which you don't have, uh, knowledge of the market, the uh, construction, whatever it is. But what you look for is honesty, integrity, and a feeling of comfort that you can be comfortable doing business with them and that they will deliver what they think they're going to deliver and that you, you're satisfied with that relationship and then just see that they deliver. So it's a, it's like, a, what do you look for in a marriage? A business partnership is effectively some kind of marriage except in business. So it's a, a comfort zone. Great. That's why we're successful. Yes. And um, the second question is, George, having worked with Donald Trump and JT Fox, what is their fundamentals to their success? The fundamentals to their success, well, I can only, do, you would put, let's take them separately because it's hard to, you can't put them together in uh, this. As far as Donald Trump's success, building a great organization uh, and creating various divisions in his, uh, in his organization which he was satisfied with so that he could not micromanage but he could end up with broad strokes. So he could come and say, here's the deal I want to make, George, do it. Yeah. And then he could go on to the next deal and it's my job basically to fill in all the gaps and see the stuff. And that's the same thing with somebody with construction or financing and what to fill in all the gaps. And then have the faith that they will do the job so that you're satisfied, you can trust them. And then you, it enables you to do any number of jobs. So that was basically his success. He built a wonderful organization. And uh, with his leadership, he'd pick out the deals and uh, whatever had to be done and had all people implement it. We had the relationship with the banks and what have you to accomplish what it is. That's the key to his success. He also installed uh, in, in his organizations a, a spirit, a spirit de corps that they wanted to be there. It was Trump. It was a vibrant organization. It was going somewhere, and he was very close to his employees. And that's it. As far as JT is, JT Fox is concerned, he is relatively new on the marketplace. He's a wonderful personality. He got a tremendous amount of uh, a push and, uh, and, and energy. Uh, I think he lacks at the present time. I don't know. I don't know what the final focus is. I really don't know. And hopefully he, he will find it. Is it making a a billionaire? Want to want to be a billionaire? Is it building an organization? Is it setting up uh, the the uh, information for uh, students and, and helping them? All of the above. But somewhere you've got to focus on it. And the only thing I see different, I don't see a degree of focus at the present time. Hopefully later on you'll find a degree of focus. Because you can't handle everything for everybody. So you have to say, this I can do or this I can't do, and throw out the ones that uh, don't make sense. I haven't seen that that's where he is at the present time. But as far as energy is concerned, nobody's got more energy. As far as the organization is concerned, he's got a long ways to go because if it wasn't J.T. Fox, what happens to the organization? Uh, he hasn't built an organization which can survive without him because he's the talent. That's right. And we're ultimately learning from those um, leaders in the field and we're basically building our success on theirs. Great. That's the way to do it. Great. Thank you. Thank you You're very welcome. much. Thank you. Good luck.